four, three, two, one. For the ability to expand your knowledge, you must be able to retain the information. The likelihood in remembering everything you sense is so low that approximately only 15 people claim that they have the eidetic memory. While those fortunate individuals have ways in remembering multiple information effortlessly, the rest of us have to study to be able to retain most of the information we want to keep for any need. Many people will begin studying, but by the end of it, they were only able to remember less than half of what they studied. This is difficult to accumulate because many of us will study hours upon hours and yet we are unable to remember the majority. How can this be possible? Study shows that people have different preference in learning and our brains remember most based on our strongest learning ability. The three types of learning abilities are auditory, visual, and kinesthetic. The audio or oral learners are good listeners who normally learn best through verbal presentation like lectures and speeches. Visual thinking, also known as visual spatial learning or picture thinking, is the ability to think and analyze what you have seen. Bodily kinesthetic intelligence is the capacity to manipulate objects and use variety of physical skills. This intelligence also involves a sense of timing and perfection of skills through mind-body union. Athletes, dancers, surgeons, and crafts, people exhibit well-developed bodily kinesthetic intelligence. There are nine main learning styles. Visual or spatial learner. Visual learners are those who prefer learning by observing things using visual aids, pictures, images, diagrams, and whiteboards. It helps these learners to understand information better. Musical intelligence is the capacity to discern pitch, rhythm, timbre, and tone. This intelligence enables us to recognize, create, reproduce, and reflect on music, as demonstrated by composer, conductors, musicians, vocalists, and sensitive listeners. Interestingly, there is an often effective connection between music and the emotions, and mathematical and musical intelligence may share common thinking processes. Verbal or linguistic learner. These learners prefer using words both in speech and writing. They can easily express themselves and usually love to read and write. Physical or kinesthetic learner. These learners are all about the sense of touch. Physical activities and sports play a big part in these students' lives. Getting hands-on is a must for these learners who love to tinker and learn best when they can do rather than see or hear. Logical or Mathematical Learner if there is logic, reasoning, and numbers involved, these learners are sure to excel. The student function and solve complex problems by employing strategies and in a specific way of thinking. Social Interpersonal Learner Learning in groups and working with others is favored by social learners. These students know how to communicate effectively and enjoy collaborating with others, brainstorming and discussing ideas and concepts. Solitary or intrapersonal learner. These students prefer to use self-study and work alone. They are independent, very self-aware, and in tune with their thoughts and feelings. Naturalist is the ability to recognize one's connection to nature, apply science theory to life. Existential Sensitivity and capacity to tackle deep questions about human existence, such as the meaning of life, why do we die, and how did we get here. It is a reflective and deep thinking design abstract theories. After knowing which will help you remember better, this will help you in different styles of studying, which are note-taking, reading and marking, planning for research paper, and time management. 
knowing the best strategy and how our study style tied will help us make the best study style that fit us individually. By discovering and better understanding your own learning styles, you can employ techniques that will improve the rate and quality of your learning. Knowing your learning style enables you to use your strength as you study for course. Learning styles refers to an individual's preferred way of processing new information for efficient learning. It defines people by how they learn, based on individual strengths, personal preferences, and other factors such as motivation and favored learning environment. It may be useful to help students and educators understand how to improve the way they learn and teach. Everyone has their own learning style by understanding other people's needs with know-how best to support them to learn.